Today we're diving into one of the most fascinating concepts in cosmology and philosophy, the anthropic principle. This principle suggests that the universe's laws and constants are fine-tuned in such a way that they allow for the existence of observers like us. Let's explore what this means and the implications it has for our understanding of the universe. The anthropic principle is the idea that the universe must have certain fundamental properties in order for life to exist. These properties include the laws of physics, the constants of nature, and the conditions present in the universe. If any of these were even slightly different, life as we know it wouldn't be possible. Essentially, the universe seems to be perfectly set up to support life. There are two main types of the anthropic principle. The weak anthropic principle, WAP, and the strong anthropic principle, SAP. The WAP suggests that we observe the universe the way it is, because if it were different, we wouldn't be here to observe it. The AP goes a step further, suggesting that the universe must have properties that allow life to develop at some stage in its history. One of the key arguments for the anthropic principle is the fine-tuning of the constants of nature. For example, the strength of the electromagnetic force, the gravitational constant, and the ratio of the masses of protons and neutrons are all precisely balanced. Even the slightest deviation in these constants could make the formation of atoms, stars and galaxies impossible, hence preventing life from existing. The fine-tuning of the universe raises an important question. Is it mere coincidence? Or is there a deeper reason behind it? Some scientists and philosophers argue that the fine-tuning is simply a result of the vast number of universes in the multiverse, each with different properties. In this view, we just happen to live in one of the rare universes that support life. The multiverse hypothesis suggests that our universe is just one of many, each with its own set of physical laws and constants. According to this idea, it's not surprising that we find ourselves in a universe that supports life, because out of the countless possible universes, at least one would have the right conditions. This provides a potential explanation for the fine-tuning we observe. The anthropic principle also has significant theological implications. Some theists see the fine-tuning of the universe as evidence of a designer or creator who set the conditions specifically to allow for the existence of life. This view posits that the precise nature of the universe is not a random accident, but rather a purposeful design. From a scientific perspective, the anthropic principle is both intriguing and controversial. While it offers a potential explanation for the fine-tuning of the universe, it also challenges scientists to think about the nature of scientific explanations. Is the anthropic principle a scientific hypothesis, or is it a philosophical statement? This question remains open to debate. Critics of the anthropic principle argue that it is a tautology, stating the obvious fact that the universe must have the properties it does for us to exist and observe it. They claim that it doesn't provide a real explanation for why the universe is the way it is. Others argue that it can't be tested or falsified, making it less useful as a scientific theory. Despite the criticisms, the anthropic principle has influenced cosmological research. It has led scientists to consider why the constants of nature are what they are and to explore the possibility of other universes. It encourages a broader perspective on our place in the cosmos and the conditions necessary for life. The anthropic principle continues to inspire research in both cosmology and philosophy. Future discoveries in physics and astronomy may shed more light on the fine-tuning of the universe and the possibility of a multiverse. Understanding these principles better could lead to new insights into the nature of reality and our place within it. The anthropic principle challenges us to consider why the universe is just right for life. Whether viewed through a scientific, philosophical, or theological lens, it raises profound questions about the nature of existence and the universe. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments below.